Hi everyone. In this tutorial, we're going to go over merging cells in Google Sheets. Merge simply means to grab a cell and drag it across so it incorporates all the other cells or down and incorporates all the other cells. So let's get started. So we've got some data here in cell A1. We want to merge it across to the right. I can click cell A1 and then drag across to C1 and then go up here where it says merge cell and click. Simple. If I wanted to merge down, I can do the same thing. I can click here and I can drag it down or I can hit shift and then down to say six. Let's see how that looks and click merge cell. Ah, well, it did merge it down, but it doesn't look all that great. So we can unclick that to merge cell. Now, one thing you'll note too is some of the formatting uh, gets lost when you unmerge something. So we need to keep that in mind. So let's click that again, hold shift down, and let's go to all, all the way down to A8. Click on that and hit merge cell. Perfect. Okay, so we can also merge across and down at the same time. So let's click on this E1 cell and let's drag across to F and down to F3. There, yeah, looks pretty good. And hit merge cell. No worries. Now, I have a piece of text here that says merge this text over some other stuff. And I'm going to merge it over uh, to F4 and down to F5. So all the way across and then down to here. Now, you'll find that you'll get a warning when we do this. So let's try it out. So I'm going to hold this and hold Shift down and click F5 to select that range. And then I'm going to hit the merge cells and we get a heads up warning. Merging cells will only preserve the top leftmost value. Merge anyway. Yeah, no worries. Okay. If we hit undo, as the message says, we will lose some of the information that was there previously. So let's do that. And it's gone. Okay. So let's merge that again. And hit click. Now we can also merge up or to the right as well. But there's a little trick here that you need to keep in mind. So if I want to merge over to the left, I can click here. And that should say to the left. Should write it on my hand, shouldn't I? So if I wanted to merge over to the left, I can hold shift down and click H4 and hit merge. But when I unmerge, you'll find that this merge to the left text will belong in the H4 cell. So let's have a look. And as you can see, if I click on H4, the text is there, but in its original cell, I4, it no longer exists. The same occurs if we merge up. So if I go up and merge, and now this text will exist in the H1 cell when I unclick it, but it won't exist in the other ones. Okay, let's do a quick example. So I've got some text here I've got that I need to do some merging on. And this might be something that you could uh, possibly be doing in your day-to-day -day work life. So let's click on this A1. I'm going to click, hold shift down all the way over to AC1. From there, I'm going to hit merge. Cool. This student column here, I could probably push this down a bit as well. So uh, we can more clearly see that this is the student column. So I'm going to hold this down and drag this down to here and hit merge. That looks a bit better. With these weeks, let's make it clear that these are separated by weeks. We can do this by doing another merge and then we'll, that will cut out all these borders. So this time I'm going to hold shift down just before week two, hit merge, again, hit merge, again, hit merge, and again, hit merge. Cool, as you can see using these merge, uh, merge cells makes things look a whole lot tidier when you're producing your reports in Google Sheets. Okay, I'll see you in the next tutorial.